Welcome back to another episode of Kavanaugh's Corner. Today on the show, I'm very excited to bring you a review of a movie that uh, I've always liked. Uh, it's always been a, a favorite of mine in terms of action and science fiction films. And uh, it's also one of these uh, action movies that I remember seeing on TV when I was a kid. And now looking back at it, I couldn't believe how horribly edited it was. <laughs> Because um, this movie has some really, really uh, intense, like, over-the-top, like, graphic violence that uh, the director is known for. And that is, of course, Total Recall here, starring Arnold Schwarzenegger and uh, Paul Verhoeven, the director, who is uh, one of my favorite directors, honestly. Um, this, along with Robocop, two of my favorite, like, action science fiction films. Uh, this one here is really crazy. This is a wild movie if you've ever seen it. And I was really glad to see that this got a 4K restoration on its 30th anniversary. This came out, um, I want to say probably about a month or so ago. Um, I was a little slow with the review because I really wanted to, to check it out and uh, really, you know, study the film, but also wanted to check out all the special features and stuff that it came with. And it does come with a lot of stuff. And this is actually a three-disc set. I'm going to take the slip cover off here so you guys can see. Um, it also includes a digital copy that redeems in 4K, which is nice. But here's uh, the three-disc set. This is the 4K disc here. And then it has the uh, second Blu-ray and the uh, third disc, which is the uh, special features on the Blu-ray there. So you do get the movie in three formats, which is nice, and a whole load of special features. And this is a release from Lionsgate, and uh, they do some pretty great jobs with their 4K discs and their sets. And uh, this was no different. Uh, now, I'm not going to be reviewing the movie itself. I'm going to be talking about the 4K disc and some of the special features, especially the newer special features. Because uh, this movie's actually been out on Blu-ray a few times now. But uh, what did I think about Total Recall here in 4K? Well, I have to say, first and foremost, I've seen this movie a few times now, uh, quite a few times actually, dating all the way back to VHS days. And I have to say, this new presentation in 4K really blew me away. Uh, this is a Dolby Vision uh, disc. So it does have Dolby Vision and HDR10. I watched it in Dolby Vision. And I have to say, this movie just looks incredible. Uh, absolutely incredible with that Dolby Vision HDR. Uh, right from the opening shots uh, during that dream sequence there where he's on Mars, you can really uh, purely see that the reds of Mars are much more vibrant now. And I mean almost to the point where it looks oversaturated. But it really is eye-popping, uh, if you mind the uh, pun there. Uh, if you see the movie, you get that joke. But anyway, they, uh, they really do a great job with really enhancing the colors throughout. And I mean that in every way. Blues, greens, reds. Uh, this movie's got a lot of blood in it. It's a very uh, graphically violent movie. And uh, even blood and stuff in this movie really is kind of uh, ridiculous looking. It's, it's really intense. Um, you know, the explosions and stuff that are in the film really are incredible looking as well. The whole color palette really just seems to be enhanced to the nth degree. Um, you know, the detail level is also something else that I noticed in this film that is really fantastic. I didn't notice any kind of DNR used in the film. The movie looks very, very crisp and clear. Again, they did a great job with restoring the film. And they did not use a lot of edge enhancement or DNR or anything. So the movie looks really clean. And there is a fine layer of grain throughout the film. When some of the uh, effect shots come into play, there is kind of noticeable grain. In, you know, there's a little bit more grain in that, uh, in those moments, I should say. And that's because of the fact they were using old school methods. You know, there's not really a lot of CGI. There is no real CGI in this movie. And the, uh, the moments where they use some of those composite effects and stuff like that, you can really tell now 
But overall, I think the special effects in this movie have actually aged really, really well. And overall, I think the picture quality on this disc is kind of mind-blowing. I really, really loved it. And, you know, I didn't notice any kind of issues with the, with the restoration work or any kind of problems with it. I just noticed that the colors were way more vibrant. Detail level is, again, through the roof in this. Um, again, right down to, you know, wear and tear on Arnold's clothing. Um, you know, some of the damage that he takes in the movie. He gets his arm kind of messed up near the end of the film. And those kind of things really stand out. And I will say, uh, because of this clarity, the violence in the movie is is much more noticeably graphic now. And it, I mean, it was pretty noticeable before on the standard Blu-ray that came out a few years ago, which was not a bad Blu-ray at all. But this one here really takes it uh, to a whole other level. And I have to say, combined with the Dolby Vision and the uh, the 4K resolution, just how well they cleaned up this movie, it's a fantastic viewing. Now, the other thing I want to mention about this new restoration is that they also gave it a Dolby Atmos soundtrack. And that new Atmos track is, yet again, fantastic. Jerry Goldsmith's score in this movie is really something to behold. And just from the opening credit sequence, you really, you know, can really, you know, get into that music. It, it's uh, kind of heart-pounding type music and really gets you in the mood for a really great action film. And the score is like that throughout the film. I mean, the Stolby Atmos track is clear as can be. Now, the, I did not notice a lot of overhead stuff uh, put in the mix. It really seems to be just an improvement over the prior 5.1 release from other Blu-rays and stuff, but I have to say it was really, really well done. Um, dialogue is crisp and clear. The sound effects are fantastic. The other thing I want to mention, too, is that a lot of times when they do these Dolby Atmos mixes or they remix the movie, I did not notice a lot of sound effects changing. And some other films, uh, Scarface probably most notably, whenever they remix the film, if it's an older film, sometimes they'll change like the sound effects for gunshots or explosions, things like that. I really didn't notice that in this. It really sounded like they just kind of took the original soundtrack and enhanced it, which is really the overall theme for this disc is the fact that they didn't really take the film and change it entirely. They just enhanced it to really make it a more uh, enjoyable 4K viewing. And I will say, for a home theater test out, this is a real good one. That that Dolby Atmos track is loud. And uh, it's not overly loud, but it's loud to the point where um, you really feel yourself in, you know, part of the action. And overall, I think the movie is a very, very enjoyable watch still to this day. You know, here we are 30-something years later, 30 years uh, uh, just a little over 30 years now, but, you know, again, the movie just really sounds great. Uh, it looks better than it ever has. And I gotta say, uh, my hat's off to Studio Canal, who did the remaster for this. They yet again hit it out of the park, and I absolutely loved it. They did a great job with this. Um, some other stuff I want to mention was the special features. Now, Lionsgate's been really great with putting a bunch of their special features actually on the 4K disc. And they did it again with this release here. And uh, the big standout special feature for this new set is one actually about Carol Co., uh, which is the company that produced this film along with many other uh, big hit films. And I really love the fact that it is basically a full-length documentary about that production company, how they got started, and really what put them out of business. And it's, uh, it's an interesting watch if you're really into movies like I am, if you really want to know some of the backstory of how certain movies got made, and how really um, that company was really great with directors. They worked with Paul Verhoeven uh, a couple times. This and uh, Basic Instinct, and also Showgirls, which uh, I'm not really going to get into here. But anyway, they, <laughs> they, uh, they go into this, and it's an interesting watch. I thought it was very, very informative, and it was nice to hear from people that were actually there. And some of the directors, I mean, they interview Paul Verhoeven, Michael Douglas. I mean, a lot of great people in that. And, uh, you know, just, again, very, very good documentary. I really liked it. 
Um, they also talked about the, um, the actual score of Total Recall, um, talking to other people that are very uh, knowledgeable experts in, uh, in film scores and talking about how Jerry Goldsmith really outdid himself with this movie. And uh, it's a little featurette about that. And there's also a featurette about the development of the film, and uh, that one's called Dreamers Within the Dream Developing Total Recall, which is another little featurette. I like that. And then they actually carried over um, a lot of the older featurettes and stuff from the older Blu-rays, including uh, a whole little featurette about the special effects called... Uh, the Total Recall, the special effects featurette, which is pretty neat. Um, and again, you got uh, the making of Total Recall, Imagining Total Recall, which is like a whole documentary about the making of the film. And there's also an audio commentary with Arnold and Paul Verhoeven as well. So that's really cool. But uh, overall, I have to say, really love this disc. This is a great three-disc set from, uh, from Lionsgate here and their uh, collaboration with uh, Studio Canal. Again, you know, these guys are really knocking it out of the park with these 4K releases, and this is one I can highly recommend, especially since the price point of it is actually really affordable right now on Amazon. And uh, if you like this movie, it really doesn't get any better than this. This is a great 4K release. I'm really glad I picked it up when I did. And uh, this is one I can see myself re-watching again and again in the future. So, big thumbs up for me for uh, Total Recall. I love this, uh, this disc. Well, anyway, that's it for today for Kavanaugh's Corner. I want to say thank you all for coming back to the channel and uh, watching my reviews here. If you really want to support the channel, the best thing to do is subscribe below. Uh, we're getting close to about 1,600 subscribers, so it's pretty crazy how this is, uh, how this is going so far. And I can uh, only say thank you very much from the bottom of my heart to all of you that do subscribe. And if you like this review, hit that thumbs up. That also helps me out here on the channel. So until next time, thank you very much for coming back to the channel. And uh, please, out there, everyone out there, stay safe and take it easy.